All right, some sad news, folks. Beloved XRT radio personality Lynn Bramer died last weekend. What are your thoughts on his legacy here in Chicago, Dave? Oh, he was a beloved figure. And, and uh, you know, he was the voice that many people woke up to day in and day out. And he was really a poet. Um, you, you know, uh, people who tuned over uh, on the dial a little bit to the right uh, at WXRT heard him uh you know, talk on uh, his, his segments of Lens Bin. I mean, I, I was listening to one the other day called, uh, you know, Why Does Time Go So Fast? And it was such a thoughtful kind of uh, essay yeah. about about just everything imaginable. He, he was just a, a really... He was known for that. A brilliant guy. And I, you know, you know it's, it, there are a million Lynn Bramer stories in this town because, you know, you, all you have to do is go to social media and you see that he, he did selfies with anybody who asked and, and they look genuine. And, you know, I, I had a, I think it was back in 2014, I had a, a situation over at the Sun-Times and, and, you know, within a short period of time, like he was, he had kind of reached out and, and we became oddly words with friends partners. And the thing, and, and the that. thing about uh, words with friends was that he, he would smoke me most times. And it was like, how's this radio guy smoking a writer? Right. And, and it's like, it was quite well. And my, my, I, you know, there are many, many more people in this oh. town who are closer friends with him. And, but, but at this, you know, I, I know when he went on the air in November, you know, and he, he, it, it was important for him to, you know, basically reconnect with his listeners. And, and, you know, it was such a, a brilliant performance where, you know, his voice was weakened, but he brought that same magic back. Yeah. You know, I sent him a note on the, on the words with friends, little Did text you? thread. And I said, great show. And, and what he said in response was, I tried. You know, and it was such a, uh, you know, a heartfelt kind of moment. And he was known for his line, uh, your best friend in the whole world. And he was. He was that to, to all of Chicago. We just, you know, we're truly all going to miss that man. Yeah. Rest in peace, Lynn.